Finally, in this fourth video about the reported speech for fourth of VSO, we are going to you are going to practice some examples in different tenses with different people, different time expressions, so that you can practice how to change from reported to from direct speech to reported speech. So the first one, Susan said, this is direct speech. Susan said, I have a big house now. So you have to do it. You have to think who is talking, Susan. She's speaking in the first person, I have. She is using a present simple. I have a big house and she is using a time expression now. So, Susan is speak, speaking in the first person, but now we are going to report what Susan said. Susan said that, first we use that clause, Susan said that she, yeah, we are talking about her. We cannot say I, because I is always me. Susan said that she. From the present simple, we have to swift change into the past simple. So, Susan said that she had a big house that doesn't change, and the word now becomes then, yes? So, Susan said that she had a big house then. Let's imagine that it is a negative sentence. Susan said, direct speech. Susan said, I don't have a big house now. Reported speech. Susan said that she didn't have a big house then. So, don't have is present. It changes into didn't have. Good. You do this one. Phil said, my mom wants to come with me to the game tonight. I'll repeat it for you. M Phil said, Phil, Philip, Phil said, my mom wants to come with me to the game tonight. I'm giving you time to do it on your own. Phil said that, now, whose mom? My mom? Not. Whose mom? Phil's mom, yes? So, Phil said that his mom wants, is in the present simple. We have to put it into the past simple. So, Phil said that his mom wanted to come to come infinitives don't change yeah in the original phil said my mom wants to come with me to come doesn't change when we report it when we report his words so phil said that his mom wanted there is a change there wanted to come to come doesn't change with, with whom? Con quien? With whom? Phil said that his mom wanted to come with him to the game. And now when? Tonight becomes that night. So, Phil said 
that his mom wanted to come with him to the game that night. Okay? Good. Now, an example with the present continuous. So imagine this direct sentence. Julia told me, my parents are buying me a new mobile phone for my birthday next month. I'll repeat it for you. My parents are buying me a new mobile phone for my birthday next month. Julia told me my parents are buying me a new mobile phone for my birthday next month. So pay attention to pronouns. Pay attention personal pronouns or pronouns. Pay attention to possessive adjectives. Pay attention to verb tense and pay attention to a time words in this case next month. So, Julia told me that los padres de quién? Los suyos, ¿no? De Julia. Sus padres de ella. Julia told me that her parents, right? Julia told me that her parents. Now, present continues, changes into past continues, correct? So, Julia told me that her parents, so from are buying, her parents were buying. ¿A quién le compran el qué? So, Julia told me that her parents were buying her, a ella. In the original, my parents are buying me. Yes? So, her parents, she told me that her parents were buying her. Le compraban a ella. What? A new mobile phone. For, para el cumpleaños de quién? For her birthday. ¿Cuándo? Next month. Next month, esto fue el año pasado cuando se lo dijeron. So, next month is the following month. Or the month after, you can say. Okay, the following month. So, again, Julia told me, my parents are buying me a new mobile phone for my birthday Next month, Julia told me that her parents, sus padres, were buying, le compraban, were bu buying her, a ella, a new mobile phone for her birthday, para su cumpleaños, the following month. Okay. Now, an example in the past simple. Let's use the past simple. Mark said, My friend broke her leg yesterday. Mark said, Mark dijo, Mi amiga se rompió la pierna ayer. My friend broke her leg yesterday. So what does the past simple change into? Past simple changes into? Past perfect. So Mark said that. My friend, mi amigo no, su amigo de él, su amiga, vamos. Mark said that his friend. Now, break, broke, broken. Yes, break, broke, broken. Mark said, my friend broke her leg. My, Mark said that his friend had broken her leg, and now yesterday, yesterday becomes the day before, or the previous day. Mark said that his friend had broken her leg the day before. Negative. My friend didn't break her leg yesterday. 
My friend didn't break her leg yesterday. Okay, you try it. Mark said that his friend and now past perfect negative hadn't broken her leg the day before. Perfect. Good. Present perfect. Another example now in the present perfect. Lisa told her mom, I haven't seen your car, your new car yet. I haven't. Again, Lisa told her mom, I haven't seen your new car yet. No he visto tu coche nuevo todavía. Lisa le dijo a su madre. Lisa told her mom, I haven't seen your new car yet. So the present perfect changes into, into the past perfect again. So the past simple, both the past simple and the present perfect change into the past perfect. So Lisa told her mom that, quien no había visto, Lisa dice I, así que es Lisa, that she, yes, Past perfect, hadn't seen her new car yet. So again, direct, Lisa told, told her mom, I haven't seen your new car yet. Lisa told her mom that she hadn't seen her new car yet. Okay, what happens if, so we have seen that Past simple and present perfect change into past perfect. What happens if we have a sentence in the past perfect? Well, it happens the same thing as in Spanish. It doesn't change at all. It doesn't change. The tense doesn't change. There is no past form of the past perfect. So, uh, Joey said, my dad had already finished. Mi padre ya había terminado. Ma Joey said, my dad had already finished. In Spanish, mi padre ya había terminado. Pues Joey said, Joey dijo que su padre ya había terminado. No cambia. Cambian. Other words can change. So, Joey said that his dad, my dad, becomes his dad. Joey said that his dad had already finished. Ya había terminado. Okay. Future. An example with will. Future will. Jane told us. Jane nos dijo. I will be there tomorrow. I'll be there tomorrow. Estaré allí mañana. Jane told us. I'll be there tomorrow. Jane told us, nos dijo, that who will be there tomorrow? Jane, yes? So it's she. Jane told, told us that she and now will becomes would. Yes, we use the conditional. Okay, so Jane told us that she would be there. And now tomorrow becomes the following day. The word there doesn't change because there is there. Here becomes there, but there doesn't become anything. There is there, unless we know where it is. Okay, so Jane told, oh, sorry, Jane told us, I'll be there tomorrow. Jane told us that she would be there the following day. Estaré allí mañana. Esto nos lo dijo hace un mes. Nos dijo, Jane nos dijo que ella estaría allí no aquí, allí, 